This one's gorgeous too. I yeah. love this one. Almost everything from this year, I've just been like, wow, and just sit and stare at it for so long on my phone. Just that that breaking away that space once again. Like, I bet there are certain times where your minds, it, even if you don't even know it, I, I'd almost guarantee there's gonna be some times where, like, I bet it's more contour lines around like shoulders, elbows, things like that, knees, whenever you want to express that, of course. And then I bet for more hair, clothes, things that are a bit more, I don't know what the word I'm looking for, but this feels like, it explains it very good. <laughs> it has a bit of texture. <laughs> right, some yeah. Sort of like uh, there's some volume to it. Yeah, like I bet those are, hair. Yeah, volume, yeah. yeah, that's a good word. I bet things with volume, those are the times I bet when you use a lot more of the washes, but Nonetheless, though, yeah, like your your mark making, the way you differentiate on things, the weight in terms of how you have, like the the line weight on this and how it's going from something very thick, and then you could doing that calligraphy type type getting thinner. Those are little tricks, little things that uh, I hate to say tricks. The little mm -hmm. techniques mm -hmm. that I'm still learning. You know, mm -hmm. I, I love that. I, like, yeah. The worst thing I think would be the day where I, I didn't learn something new about how to uh, use this material, like mm -hmm. this medium. You know? Right. Because when, when you're, you're doing it at a high level, like when you feel like you're really under control and you know what you're doing, like that's fun. There's a lot of confidence that you gain from that. Mm -hmm. But, you know, I, I, when I see someone who's really, really good at what they do, like I want them to do something different. Mm -hmm. I want them to push themselves a little further to get on that edge where they're not, it doesn't look like they're in control anymore. Right. That's where I feel like the best stuff, like I said, comes from is that. Yeah, yeah, see I had a theory, but you proved me wrong on this oh. one. Oh, really? Well, you did, <laughs> there are lines, but then you use the negative space between her inside of her arm and her body and use the wash for that <laughs> like, and then you like fuck the outside of it we're going in the negative space bro that's so dope that's I amazing know. and those are the those are the little things that i love the most is like right. try something that doesn't seem right doesn't right. feel right to me it's like no I, I know it's gonna work if i do it this way but if i do it this way how can i make it work right and in a traditional photo or if it was one of Kyle's super overly detailed drawings from back in my day, or even if you call me in an overly detailed moment right now, of course, whatever's right there, that gray would be, everything would be gray behind it, and then it would just take away from that positive negative interplay, and yeah, man, less is more so many times, and that's one of them great, great, fantastic depictions of it. And when you, when you start doing these things like this, then all of a sudden, like later down down the line, I'll have this great idea for a drawing, and I'll know what to do. You know, mm -hmm. like if I'm not pushing myself and trying new things, like I wouldn't come up with this new idea, and I wouldn't be able to execute.